Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim Assalamu uh, alaikum students This is a program in which we learn how to insert element into the array uh, uh, into a specified position So we got uh, some prototypes here One is the input in which we take the input uh, and display which uh, displays the array elements and insert wherein we pass this insert an array and uh, the two integer variables and del uh, which deletes a particular element, right? So, and we have some global variables, as int i and so on. Okay, then int main, uh, whatever. So, this is an array and i num and position. Uh, we have the i, loop variable i, and we have a num. Uh, and we have a position. So, we'll see what we're using. So, first we say the limit. And we say less than, it should be less than 10 because we have 10 and we put that into limit and then we call the input and send AR in this input we will get simply the array elements from the user then in the display we get simply uh, display the array elements and we pass in the array AR so when you pass the array AR to the function one dimensional array so never uh, write the boxes here write simply the array name which is a pointer in fact and it's passed by reference arrays always gets passed by reference so then you, you are asking the position and element to insert where you want to put that element into so that you go get into the position and num so that's why we have a position position is in which position you want to insert and what is uh, that number which you want to insert and you call the insert and you pass here the array the position and the num that's why three in the prototype also we saw so then we will also again display it and then you will like to delete it and in the delete you want to say which position you want to delete and uh, you call the del the array and the position of the element to which you want to delete and then you display back uh, the array element so this is simply the del which uh, catches the array a you have mentioned here the box and uh, the position in the p so what you do is for i equals p minus one so you will start so you will start you know uh, the loop from position minus one because uh, if a user says position three but in the array the element uh, is at the position two because it starts from zero so we have to start a loop from that element which he, which basically the user says up to the uh, limit limit is uh, when we have initialized the array and uh, we ask the limit up to that position less than that because if the limit is seven we must have out of six index in array so we will that means from the position element uh, which he want to delete to the end of the array what you do is in that position you will get the next element into it so that uh, element is overwritten then I mean, with the next loop, it the next element goes into the previous element. Next one goes in the previous element, and <coughs> your last element will be there. But we say limit minus minus, so our limit uh, is now lesser because we have lesser elements now, right? Or you could have said that the last element, you know, a of i, at the end of the for loop, that a of i equals zero, uh, right? So similarly, we have insert, but in insert, what we do is we had to first, uh, you know, shuffle all the elements from that position. If user is taking some position from that to the end. We have to shuffle all to the right, one one place, so that we keep place, keep, you know, uh, empty space for the element to be inserted. That's n. So what I'm doing is from from the limit minus one. That's the end, end uh, of the array element. That's last element. From that position, I start up to the position okay and I come back I minus minus what I do is I <coughs> go to the one position up you know the last element uh, this means uh, out of the first time it will be the last element limit minus one is the last element so I is the last element so last element and so on so if you're going to go to one step and one step and so, sub positions जहाँ जहाँ आपकी position है, वहाँ से सब आगे गए होंगे सब, और position जहाँ पे है, वो वाला element जो होगा, वो आप override कर सकते हैं, क्योंकि वो आगे गया होगा already. So, इसलिए a of p minus one, that is the position जो आपके बता रहे हैं आप, उसमें आप n डालो, ये element डालो, and limit को plus plus करो, क्योंकि एक element आपका ज़्यादा हो गया, right? So, similarly we have then the display, wherein we basically, you know, up to the limit we uh, print out the array elements. 
uh, what is the display or something like this is input okay you are scanning of you are scanning the elements and you're displaying the plain old you know uh, functions okay so this is how to insert uh, array elements and how to delete uh, array element right that's it